Uh, so James, your thoughts on today's performance? Uh, mixed really, we didn't deserve to win. They give credit to Maidenhead, uh, they fully deserved the win. Um, warned the players about what to expect when they got here all week. You know, we haven't delivered anywhere near what I expect and the staff expect. So, um, But it comes down to me, I'll pick the wrong team, trust the wrong players and uh, we've come unstuck today. In what way have you picked the wrong team, do you feel? Goalie punched it down the field 70 yards and we don't get any contact and he delivers it in. Mm -hmm. So the boy delivers it in one touch and they score for one touch. Something seriously wrong. Um, you can't plan for that. That comes down to individual first and second contacts and we've just not delivered. Um, and the second goal, the boy should get the delivery and we should at least foul and, and stop the delivery. That hasn't happened, so we haven't done the the small details and when you come to a ground like this, uh, conditions like this, um, full credit to them, like I said, there's no holy grail of playing football, you know what's coming, they're direct, they land on first, uh, they get first and second contacts and they try and pin you in on the slope. Um, I'm really disappointed with that performance but we, we won't dwell, like we don't dwell on the victories, we, I've learnt, I know what mm. I've learnt today, I've learnt a lot about individuals and collective units, what works, what hasn't worked so far in my 17 games. And um, we'll go again on Tuesday. Um, we haven't got time to, to sulk. Um, just take our lessons. Yeah. Um, be brave, though, in the defeat and give credit to the opposition. Because um, I'm not a bad loser like that. Um, we have to lose right. And we didn't. We were nowhere near our standards today. Nowhere near. Um, but like I said, we'll be back in Monday. Hard work starting again. And uh, obviously, uh, make sure we're ready for Sutton, the, the league leaders. Is this the most disappointing defeat you've had since your time at Chesterfield so far? Uh, probably the most disappointing defeat um, I've had this season really, mm. or, well not this season but the season and a half since I've started in management because um, we've got a talented group but talent doesn't be hard work did, talent doesn't work hard Did they potentially play to the conditions better than you did today? They did everything better they played to the conditions better asked more questions, more deliveries in the box one tackles, first and second contacts I could go on. Mm. Not good enough, nowhere near our standards. Um, and we don't have a divine right just to turn up anywhere in this division and think you're going to roll over the opposition, no matter what form you're in. We haven't obviously respected the opponent enough. Um, I can assure you I have, and the, and the staff have. We've done our preparation, our due diligence, but we've not delivered. So is it the general play, not just the two goals, it's overall performance, yeah, just, just, just not good enough? Nowhere near, nowhere near. Did you miss Curtis Weston in midfield today? You could say that, but we've got to be ready for that. We've got a big enough squad. Players coming in, players going out, whether there's injury or suspension, I've still rotated it. Um, and they know themselves that I'm not going to stand here and, and, and berate every individual because the performance is three losses and 17 is, is fantastic form. So we've got to remember that. We can't get too carried away. Today we're off it and give credit to Alan's team. They deserve it. Uh, you made one change apart from Curtis with... Uh... Will Evans coming in for, for Fraser. What was you thinking behind that one? Fraser won't be able to play three games in a week. Um, he's, he hasn't played for two and a half months before he came in the building. So three games in a week won't be possible. Um, we decided to go for all today. Um, and that, that was the decision that we made. Sutton up next. It's a, another tough game, isn't it? It is, but maybe they're the best games you can bounce back on because um, you know, they're flying high. Um, we were flying high up to this one. So let's see how we, we react from the adversity. The last defeat away from home. At Stockport, we reacted really well with two victories. Uh, let's see if we can do the same. Has everyone come through it okay? Any injuries? No, no, it's fine.